Hello viewers and welcome to Mon Bar Zoo. Instead of the Oddy Truck update, it is now the April update. And look at this cutie wooty. Look at you. Beautiful. Happy Easter. Valentine's. Weiss? Of course. The snowy holidays, the first anniversary, Easter. Wait a moment. That's Easter twice then. Awesome, that is. All right, you're sorted there. And you guys are actually ready to harvest. I'm um, actually, at the moment trying to get some more huge packages of this sweet green nectar there we go i've organized these tubs as well a bit more make it a bit easier on me really trying to actually harvest everything so what have I got then? Wow, it's going to be a massive harvest then. That's one huge basket already at 100%. And this is going to be close. Or actually indeed 100%. There you go. I can't believe it. Yes! That is another one down. There we go. I actually wanted to uh, test out the uh, wrapping machine. There you go. 6% only for that. So what I did is created some big bags. And if I remember correctly, the huge bag pack is equivalent to 3 by 3 dimension of the actual big bags i don't know how many that is but it's a lot there we go just took up all the big bags there and what was left over here there's nothing in there so let's put you out of the way for now i absolutely love this uh organizer the grid mode it is just fantastic it's actually made things easier and i've missed oh goodness me i've missed a fertilization stage oh well never mind all i have to do is just go ahead plant these and do it manually well there we go nice easy job so let's go and do it manually there we go refit it there you go and there you go and hey presto brilliant open you up put you in there and there you go that is the basement routine really to be honest so i need four or eight of them that is my second one so I can leave that for now. It is getting late into the day and I need to go ahead and actually do stuff. I've been working on these two cars. They're now fully painted and customized so they can go into the garage over there. I have got some fries to sell. So I'm going to do that and go ahead and find a new cone egg. Oh, blimey. A new cone egg. Right. I don't need anything. Do I? Actually, wait a sec. Nope, I've got everything. So that's the garages over there. Basically, you put your vehicles in there and... It saves your uh, FPS, which is awesome. 
Sorry if I sound a bit uh, gun ho. I'm not wanting to waste time. It is three o'clock. I need to go to the garage. I do. As well as Roger's shop and the junkyard. Bunny! So that is brilliant. Oh yeah, and drop off uh, these fries at the snack shark. Oh, come on. Woo! Coming through. I'm a hurricane. Coming through. I'm a hurricane. I'm not going to sing any more of that because, well, copyright. I don't want it. <laughs> come on. Right, let's stop. And bang, bang, bang. And with the pictures, gave me an idea of what to actually expect for this Koenig. So I have got wheel bearings already. I've already got the brake rotors as well. And I'm going to kick this second car up as a stock Koenig instead of turning it into like a racing or rally one that is the other Koenig's job look at this look at this there is just like what so I need OEMs and that is it and that is basically uh, stock. So that is the lights there. You as well, headlights. Now, I need to look for the rear lights. Headlights, clear, headlight, tail light. There you go. Put you in there as well. Why me? This is just like an outright war on Roger's store. Because you come in here and just buy everything. Alright, smoked, black, clear. Okay. Miss me. <laughs> oh, blimey. I don't think I've actually... Oh, I haven't brought any bolts. I've been collecting them and I haven't actually bought any bolts. All I would like to actually do is get a uh, get it onto some wheels. But I'm going to lose some daylight, I am. I'm going to buy what I can now, then go back organize the truck properly because the dolly should be at the garage by now front grill because if you remember I left it in a ditch I'm running out as well so OEM go back to that I don't know when this shot shuts and I need paintable, lightweight. Oh, goodness me. I guess it is just this one then. And, of course, rear seat. You. Brilliant. And exhaust. I think the exhaust at the garage is a performance one. So I need you. There we go. And I need suspension. That is you. I've already got the transmissions, so that's fine. Go. So that is the new but old manifold. 
Remember, the first ever one you got was Rusty to Heck. Performance. I do believe I need this because I was stuck. I don't know about that one. Turbo, not putting it in yet. I don't think I've actually bought this before. So that can actually be bought now. We've got enough dent repair kits. Bug light, just one. Uh, there you go. Store is shut. There we go. So we've got enough here to actually start on. So let me just get this all organized and sorted out and I'll see you back at the house. Right, it is of course the next morning and thank goodness it is morning. I've just been trying to organize this garage, get ready for this episode and I'm blind in the game, to be honest, if you're not uh, keeping up with it. So, what I have actually got so far is my original Kone up on its jacks. It was straight and I don't know why, but it's gone off course. I have got a set of rooms and a set of eyes there waiting. All the body work, what needs to be done, is there in the pile. All I would like to actually do for this episode is get the other Koenig ready to be moved. And by looking at the photos for the update, it's got nothing. No suspension, no bearings, no rotors, no brakes, no nothing. That is why I think this car will be perfect for me to actually go ahead and create a stock car. I can actually remember what my Koenig, the first Koenig, used to be like when you first start the game, basically. So I have got poutine, maple syrup, which is all awesome, and trying to think what else do I need? I need. Hmm. I've got adjustable ones. I've got the sports one over here, and the rally ones over there. Hmm. What else do I need? Right. Let's just have a bit of a gander then. All I need is for this car to actually move. So I will, of course, get all the suspension. Don't need actual cross beams quite yet. Not differential. And this actually looks to be. No, can I have the stock exhaust on? No, that can't be right. Hmm. I think I want this to be stuck I have to get the suspension what's at the garage and unfortunately with that you only get two all I need is the front so that's fine and I need you, big bolts, because I would like to do metal for all the bolts for this stock 
version. And let me take you just in case. There we go. That seems to be it. Got rims, got tyres, suspension I can get at the garage. Steering wheel I think is at Rogers. There's some seats there. You know what? I'm good to go. So, with that in mind, let's get going. So, first stop will be the garage. Alright, here we go. And when I said garage, I mean Rogers. Because he's actually, of course, first on this journey. Alright, everything's still inside and intact, which is alright. I am wondering which one is the universal steam wheel. They're actual original, but instead of it missing the airbag, it's actually got the airbag. Right, there you go. Rotors done. I need wheel bearings. There we go. And suspension. Let's have a look at suspension. I need you, of course. There we go. And not looking for the dials or anything else at the moment. Suspension, I am definitely looking at. That is the adjustable set, adjustable rally, sway bars, don't really need spaces, don't need. Is it free in here? For the tyres? I tell you something, if it is, that's awesome. Alright, you go there. Um, let's pick you up and see if this is actually indeed free. Money hasn't gone down yet. It is free! Unlike the garage where you have to actually pay. Heads up! For it. This is actually going to save space in the back of the Jeep. Heads up! Hey ho! Tally ho! What do you mean, tally ho? Come on. Right, there you go. And get the last two tyres. And that is the last. Awesome. So, that is Rorium. Right, you can go there. You, there, you, there. Um, you there, you up to 35. 35. Come on with the 35. There you go. Done. Brilliant. There you go. Absolutely fantastic. There you go. And get the rim. Up you there, get you, and here in the 35, nice, and pay a presto, that is brilliant, having this here free, that's going beyond, is Roger trying to actually overthrow the petrol station, not the garage. It's going to rake it in. I'll tell you something. I can't wait to get the lifters low, to be honest. Right, there you go. And last one. 
and I'm trying to think what else I need. And dead body, broom. Still need the suspension though. Alright, there you go. And I do need one of you. I think that is the standard bud. I may as well get that. There you go. And I cannot see the suspension. There you go. That is, of course, for the G sway bars, paint. Tires, bolts, got the back seat already, got fenders already, got doors already. That's the rear bumper. Hmm. I don't know which one to go for. Which is the original? What you started off with? Is it this one? Ah, what the heck. Let's just get it just in case. Yep. And got all that sorted out. Got the exhaust, got the transmissions. Already sorted out, got the Europe sorted. Um, I believe I've already got one of these at my house. If not, I can easily come back here. The engine, which is this one, is the stock engine. There we go. And I think that is that for now. Right. Next stop. Why is there? I don't mind. Garage. And fuel. Which side? Didn't mean to do that. Gross. Yuck. Right, it's on the left side. On the left side. Get it on the left side. Right, here we go. Let's pull up here. We can actually get some fuel. And turn you off. And... Seriously, man. Stop. And fill you up. Okay. Right. Sorry. But living Dolly, I'll tell you something. Wow, the physics on physics. You can tell it's unity, can't you? Alright. That is done. And I'm nearly done with this oh my goodness me right there you go hello fellas there you go you're a good kid you should look at the project car in the scrapyard will do I need a tray as well Put all my bolts there we go and I need a seat later there you go and you I need I need to come back tomorrow to get the other two doesn't matter there you go and of course it needs 
an exhaust, which is you. Because the original was rusty to heck. And... You. There you go. And I do believe... I've got all three of these. And which one is it? That actually has their bag in it. It must be the one what's in the Koenig already. Um, I need you. There you go. And you. Perfect. So, ABS is next. And that is you. And I don't need any jacks. Actually, I do because I got three jackable vehicles now. So I've got the truck as well as two Koenigs. So let's go ahead. And get them in there. Thank you, fellas. Now it's time to go to the junkyard. Right, coming up to the junkyard, and back there to the right is some new parts. Well, unfortunately, I go off road with what I've got in the truck now. I might end up losing everything, unfortunately. So I'm just going to continue and get to the junior. There's a lovely building there. So I need to be for now. driving in frontwards there we go and open you up handbrake on dolly off turn egg off have a quick look around look at this sweet body it's a trick and oh I just came up here just by coincidence. There's a bumper of sorts. Is that a bumper? There it is. Front bumper. Strong. There you go. Does that mean I can take... No. Can't take anything else off. It's alright. Nothing else in here. Rustic Koenig is there. Oh my goodness me. What is this? Koenig, headlight, off road. Well, now, hello there. And Steam Wheel, the original, with the airbag. <laughs> I knew it was somewhere. So we've got front, is it front? Yes, headlights. We've got headlights off-road. So we need rear headlights off-road. Where do we pick them up from then? And that car, wait. Was there always two rustic Koenigs in here? Because this is the original, original. I thought there was only one uh, scrap Koenig here. Not two. I would love to have this car instead. Look at that beefiness. Oh, hello there. Anything in here? Uh, no. Okay, then. Let's go ahead and have a look 
at Scrap Koenig. <laughs> Goodness me, that is just rubbish. It really is. A storage area. Yep. Kind of gathered that. Right. Oh my goodness me. It's got some stuff in. And it's got a pit as well. Which is awesome. Right. I need to get organized. <laughs> this is going to be fun and awesome. Right. There you go. Let's get uh, organized. Alright, so let's begin, shall we? I've actually got the car up in the air a bit further, which is awesome. So let's go ahead and get you locked. Unbolted because I rather actually swap the suspension out now rather than later. We'll put you there, you can come off, and you can go in there. I'll come down later date to actually sort you lot out. I don't really fancy having scrap stuff at mine. There we go. And there you go. Right. Do I need the sway bar in now? Don't think I do. So what I can actually do now is take it out. There we go. Right. So that is now done. There we go. All I need now is get everything fastened. So you go there. And then let's get the bolts closer. Go. You. No. One of them. Thank you. And get this all situated. And there we go. First part done. That was easy. Right. That is you done. Right. Not yet. Is it brake rotor? No. Or is it bearing to net? Where is the bearing to this side? Bearing there, there, and there. I swear I Oh, full bearing. Yeah, I did. Where is it? I'm Hudson positive. I put a bearing down here. Oh, hey, well, it's not there anymore. So, bearing in then you? Yep, it is. So, we need a bolt. Go to you. Wrong bolt. Right. Okay, then. Let's put you back in there. Put you there. 
of course, get you. And that one. There we go. Passing you in. And that. Do I put a bowl into you? Nowhere else? No. Nope. And menu. What about you? There you go. So I just have to remember that's all how it actually all goes. Wrong bolts. Okay. Unless this actually attaches to the sway bar. Right. There you go. That's probably why it's not working. Brakes. There you go. That looks to be good. And now is time to fasten the wheel on. It's been ever since I even messed with the actual tires, wheel, suspension on anything. There we go, so it has to uh, come back to me eventually. It's getting late. Right, there you go. That is now on, and now I need to switch to my fancy flashlight and carry on quickly with the rest. Right, back again. Couldn't get it all done. I had to go back in a hurry, go to sleep, sort out my routine and that, and come back. And it's 32. Okay then, so 35 is not bad, to be honest. So, let's get the ABS in over there. Wrench, come here. And. One bolt, I do you reckon? And that should be that. Yep, that's good. So, you, then you. There we go. There we go. That's good. For a moment there, I actually thought I bought two or at least four rides. So that seems to be that now. them in we need to get sway bar that's in right do the real back got oh, no bearing though on this side right let's go ahead and remove you Put you there. Remove you. Put 
put you there. Right, so, what have we got down here? Oh, them bits are for the back, not the front. Right, okay then. So, let's unbolt all this. Oh no! I've got to put the wheel on! Darn it! Hopefully that shouldn't be too bothersome. I've just got a funny feeling that this car is going to be... going inside that pit. Unfortunately. I think that was a full tray of bolts. And just getting the actual suspension sorted out, I've near enough emptied it out. Darn it, how many bolts does one car need? Can I still put a wheel on? No. Right. I don't know where that other bearing's gone. I really don't. I 100% swear I actually put a bearing down on this side. It can't have gone down there, can it? No, that's all rusty stuff. Stuff I don't need. So, I can't put one tire on. Okay then. That's fair enough. Oh, no. So, I can only have... Three wheels. Okay. Okay. Right. Let me get these wheels on. Right. That is all the wheels that I can actually put on at the moment. So, save space. Let's go ahead. And get the bonnet put on. There we go. That one and should be, yep, to each side. Fair enough. That means now I've got space actually inside the truck. Of course, that seat will go in at a different time. Right. Now. <laughs> I was just... How can I... Right. Let's... Have you so like so? Oh, no, didn't mean to do that. There you go. Come on, out you come. Right, it's coming out, but 
Not gracefully. I'm trying. Oh no, 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 no. I'm actually coax it around. There we go. Right, now it is on stable ground. Let's go ahead and see about see about ah, bolts there. Putting this on. There you go. Fantastic. It's getting there, I'll tell you something. It's definitely getting there. Alright. There you go. And there you go. Pops up easily and nicely. That is actually good, really. Right, now, the difficult part. Oh, goodness me, this is so much fun. Right, I need to be there. And hopefully, attached to the bumper. That's why I placed you there. And no, didn't want to attach to the bumper. Okay, then. Alright, come on. It is now the game of click and pull. And that looks to be good. And uh, no, I need to ho hurry up because this car's sliding off. Attach vehicle. Yes, 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 yes. I. Gone and done it! I've gone and done it! I've got you on the ground! <laughs> oh my goodness me! That is horrendous, but so funny at the same time. Oh my goodness me. Right, what I am going to do is drive. To the garage and that is where I'm going to actually end the episode it has took forever to actually get to this stage of me building the front bit of the suspension putting the wheels on and then getting the actual uh, cone egg attached to the dolly unbelievable and I'll tell you something it's, it's been amazing all the way and you know what else is going to be amazing you liking the video and subscribing to the channel have you done it you done it yet just checking in have you you have brilliant Woo! you just made me feel amazing too thank you very much because I appreciate you all so Ah, oh, goodness me. I can put the actual the missile and the race car in here and store them. I can, which is awesome, really. I'm still like, what the heck has happened to that bearing? So let's touch you. Oh, come on, mate. Come on. Come on. Right there. Detach. Thank you. Now attach. What? Never mind. Never mind. Right. 
let's quickly get back and I'm going to look at my editing and um, to see where that bearing went I need to be in first outside view let's go and back home I am oh goodness me I tell you something that was an ordeal but I made it saying that and hopefully I don't need this dolly anymore so I'm hoping to drive up here get out on attach it and leave it there. There we go. And quickly whoop. There we go. Fantastic. Thank you for shutting the door, Koenig. And there we go. There you have it. I am back. Oh. Wow. <laughs> yes, it's here. Um, I'm so relieved and chuffed that I've made it back. And you know what? This is indeed the end of the episode. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed the episode as much as I enjoyed trying to wrestle the second Scrap Kone back home. Hopefully you'll see me in the next one. Bye.